that chose McGonagall. Why? Well, they're reliable, uh, good power. Uh, we've been running them now for four seasons, um, and then uh, we really just got our first new one. Um, so I bought a used one, so, and then uh, you know we ran him basically four years, won the championship with a used motor, uh, and then this weekend we've got a brand new one in the car. This is probably my number one short track to come and drive. And it just gives that big track feel that a lot of guys never experience. This track is a really good track for our uh, 425 crate motors. Um, probably three quarters of the way down the straightaway, you really want to be chipping them pretty good here. Um, it just helps you up off, uh, and, and you'll just eat guys up with the crate motor up off the corner if you turn them right. Yeah, we had amazing power tonight. We. Uh, the most power I've had down here in, in I don't know how many years, uh, that MEP horsepower was great. Uh, the car was really good at the start. I mean, it was just on a rail. I mean, I, I could have went high, I could have went low. The guys were fighting over the bottom, so I just put it up to the top and away it went. It was really good. And again, they were just working the bottom, so I just went to the top and, and uh, we got ran up into the wall. And it definitely knocked the toe out of the car and I think maybe moved the rear end back a little bit or something. And it just, it just wasn't no good after that. I mean, it's hard to say, you know, we haven't diagnosed it, but there's concrete in the rear wheel. You can't just put concrete in the rear wheel and it'll be square. So it was a great points night for us. Um, I don't think we took the points lead, but we should be four or five points behind the points leader. Um, considering that we were 24 or 26 points behind coming into this, um, I'll take it.